took a look at adding numbers when they're adding really just based on place value. So if I'm adding just 100 or 1,000 or even a million, all these zeros tell me I'm not going to be making any change to any place value except for the digit here, the 100 or the 1 million or the 1,000. So if I'm going to be changing, I'm really just going to be adding 100 like this. Now I could go through this work and do this extra work here, but what do I notice? The only digit that changed was in the hundreds because I'm adding 100. So here if I'm going to add 100,000 to 3,846,249, I know this is the only digit that's going to change. I'm going to stay at 3 million. I'm going to go to 946,249. I don't need all those zeros. I'm using my understanding of place value to make that change. Now I'm going to add 1,000. But what I notice is that's a 9 right now, which means it's going to change to a 10. I can't quite do that. So mentally, all I'm going to do is I'm going to regroup that 1 over here. So now it's going to be 800. 50,312. I'm going to be adding 1 million. So 27 million, 306,222. So I'm going to just be changing the millions place. So it's going to be 28 million. 306,222. Now I can do the same thing even if it's not just a 1,000 or 2,000, even if it's a 3,000. I'm going to look just to my ones place, my thousands place. I'm going to add 3, so that becomes a 9. 27,309,222. And if I decided, let's say, to add 400,000 to this. Well, look, I'm just going to be changing this digit. So it's going to be 27,709,222. And then if I decide to add 3 million to this amount, well, now look, 3 million, I'm going to change the millions. Oh, that's going to turn into a 10. So what do I do? I just regroup it, it becomes 30 million. 709,222. And finally, what if I decided to add 4,000 to this? Well, I'm only going to be changed in the thousands place, but 9 plus 4 is 13, which means that I'm going to regroup a 1, so I'm going to end up with 30,713,222.